Hi YouTube, here is my small haul from Krabby Candle Company. This is the first time I'm ordering from them, so these are my first impressions. The first thing that I like about this is that these come in the small one ounce sizes, so you don't really feel like you're wasting wax. I mean, if that is such a thing. You're not really wasting wax getting the two ounce sizes if you're not happy with them. However, I do have a tendency to melt my entire two ounce um, scent shots when I get them. So, um, but you can split them in half and they're still pretty good. So, this is what you get if you cut it in half. Um, let's start with Day at the Spa. I love this scent. It smells so good. It's a really nice, clean scent. And... It's clean, but it is faint, so it's not a uh, hit-you-in-the-nose type of perfumey scent. And then um, I have white tea. This is amazing. There must be a standard for white tea in the scent business because this reminds me a little bit of Bath & Body Works, white tea and ginger, except this is not heavy on the ginger. There's no ginger in it. It's just clean white tea. Um, without anything added to it. So I love it. Then I have Sunwash Linen. If you guys are familiar with Yankee Candle, they had a Sunwash Linen which was so crazy popular and they um, discontinued it in I believe the mid 2000s if I'm not mistaken. So it's nice that they have this in a dupe um, with Krabby Candle and it is similar to Yankee Candle. It's not exactly the same, of course, but this is a great way to try it out if you missed it or if you've never tried Sunwash Linen. This is excellent. Then I have popcorn on the bottom. It's so interesting because a lot of companies will have um, kettle corn, but you don't really find a lot of plain popcorn. So I was happy to find this one. And it's going to be fun to melt on its own, but I would like to mix it with a couple other things just to see if I can get some fun scents. Okay, dirty. Getting dirty. So yeah, I got this out of sheer curiosity. It actually smells like if you're digging in potting soil and, you know, just planting plants. So it's interesting. I mean, I'm curious to know what it smells like when you melt it, but this is probably something that I'm going to want to blend with. So. It satisfied my curiosity. Okay, so over here on the bottom is squeaky clean. This reminds me of hand soap. It is a very clean, fresh scent, but it's not overly perfume. It's understated, almost powdery. Um, so it does remind me of like a, a plain bar soap. And then I have Ocean Goddess. See, with this Ocean Goddess, this is the type of ocean scent that I think I was trying to describe in other videos where there's like that nice, it's sweet, it's somewhat flowery, it's fresh. Smells outdoorsy, but then there's a trace of salty sea air. And this is exactly what I mean by the type of ocean scents that I love. So I'm glad I was able to get it in here. And, ooh, that's going to smell so good melting that. And then I have Bailey's in bed. Bailey's Irish Cream. Need I say more? So delicious. Oh my gosh. If you guys don't know what Bailey's Irish Cream is, um, I think a similar scent to this would be like buttercream or some type of frosting. So it's, it's mm, you know, similar. I mean, it gives you some idea of what it smells like. Alright, so this was my surprise of the day. Uh, my pink sugar would have come in a typical one ounce size but I open up my package and surprise I got it in two ounce so um, I'm really happy with that so I'm not complaining this is gonna be great I love pink sugar and it, pink sugar is one of those blendable scents so this is 
a generous amount that I can just chop up. I might want to add it to the popcorn. Yeah, we'll have to watch that. It's a good idea. Popcorn or maybe getting dirty. I want to try an interesting combination. So these are my two samples. I got Queen Bee and I got Buttercream Crunch. Buttercream Crunch is so delicious, almost edible. That's how yummy it smells. And there's a little bit of like peanut toffee. Yeah, that's what I'm picking up. Toffee out of the Buttercream Crunch. The Queen Bee, I do not know what it smells like. It's powdery. It's soft. I wonder if it's like a baby scent. I don't know. Who knows? But that's my haul. Thank you guys for watching. Let me know what you think. Bye.